Welcome back to Top Books. In today's video, we'll run down the top 5 best-selling books on money and why you should read them. If you are new here, please hit the subscribe button and don't forget to turn on notifications. Right, time for some top books on money. At number 5 is The Millionaire Next Door by Thomas J. Stanley and Williams D. Danko. One of the reasons that millionaires are economically successful is that they think differently. Thomas J. Stanley and William Day Danko said in their 1995's The Millionaire Next Door, The Surprising Secrets of America's Wealthy. You know what they're saying is true because the authors earned millions off their book sales and achieved the financial security they preached about in the book. The book was incredibly successful, so much so that it sold over 3 million copies worldwide. The Millionaire Next Door centers around the idea that the truly rich accumulate their wealth by living a frugal and modest lifestyle. So, people actually have two financial choices. They can choose to be wealthy, or they can choose to look wealthy. And there's a vast difference between each option. Stanley and Danko gathered their data by interviewing more than 500 millionaires and conducting over 1,000 surveys. As to not give out any spoilers, we're just going to mention the premise of the book. The authors basically divide people into two categories. Pause, which stands for Prodigious Accumulators of Wealth. They're people who are financially independent, good savers, and do not drive unexplainably expensive cars. Then you have the UAWs, who are under-accumulators of wealth, and are all about that ritzy and flashy lifestyle and lavish displays of wealth. Which do you fall into? At number 4 is The Richest Man in Babylon by George S. Clayson. Hailed as one of the greatest books on financial advice is George S. Clayson's classic, The Richest Man in Babylon. It was published nearly a century ago in 1926 and has since sold over 2 million copies. The Richest Man in Babylon is told through a series of simple parables not dissimilar to traditional biblical tales. The tales are told by the character Arkat, a scribe who became the richest man in Babylon 4,000 years ago. George S. Clayson details the path to prosperity and the importance of gold, and how even the poorest man can financially rise up to become rich. One of the first words of advice offered is to fatten thy purse, aka save money. Arkad explains the seven cures to gain and keep money and wealth, and he clarified the five laws of gold, which are to help you protect your wealth and realize how to invest it properly. Despite this book being over 90 years old, its money handling methods are still relevant to this day, especially for the younger audience or fresh graduates who are trying to get a grip on how to handle their finances. The best thing is that the book's engaging and unique story format makes it a memorable book that will stay with you forever. At number 3 is Rich Dad Poor Dad by Robert Kiyosaki. A must read for those looking to become financially secure. Rich Dad Poor Dad was written by Robert Kiyosaki and Sharon Lecter and published in 1997. Like The Richest Man in Babylon, it's told in the style of a series of parables. The book is based on Kiyosaki's life and the advice of two dads. His real father, the poor dad, who has worked all his life but has never achieved financial security, and the wise, rich dad, who is his best friend's wealthy father. The book stresses the importance of financial education and independence, as well as accumulating wealth through investments. Kaisaki advocates changing one's mindset from I can't afford this to how I can afford this. He reasons that financial literacy is achieved through experience. In the end, the most powerful asset that we have is our mind, and thus how we choose to make and spend our money. Rich Dad Poor Dad has sold over 40 million copies. Its success and popularity are made known by its spot on the New York Times bestsellers list for over six years. Billionaire and American media mogul Oprah Winfrey featured the book on her show, and the famous actor Will Smith said he used Rich Dad Poor Dad to teach his son about financial responsibility. If you haven't joined the Top Books family, please hit the subscribe button and don't forget to turn on notifications. Also, make sure to check out our other top books. Right, so we're nearly at the number one book you must read. Back to it. At number two is Secrets of the Millionaire Mind by T. Harv Eker. Secrets of the Millionaire Mind, Mastering the Inner Game of Wealth by T. Harv Eker was published in 2005. In its first week, it sold 52,000 copies and ranked number one on the New York Times, Wall Street Journal, and USA Today's bestseller lists. It even beat Harry Potter in sales in that week. The book is based on the knowledge and experience Ecker gained after earning millions through various business ventures, and then losing said millions in the span of only two years. He started researching the relationship people have with money and the difference in rich and poor people's mentalities. Ecker questioned the reasons why some people seem to breeze through life easily without financial struggles while others struggle daily. Is it because of luck? 
intelligence, or education? He illustrates that the rich have what's called a millionaire mind, and he divides the reason into a part of the book called The Wealth Files, 17 ways rich people think and act differently from poor and middle class people. Ecker states that we all have a financial blueprint, based on childhood experiences and beliefs. The book will teach you how to adopt an I create my life mentality, rather than a passive life happens to me belief. Best selling authors like Robert G. Allen, Mark Victor Hansen, and Marky Shimoff swear by this book. And at number one for the books you must read on money is Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. Now this is a game changer. Think and Grow Rich. It was written by Napoleon Hill and published in 1937, and it's absolutely a life-changing book. Billionaire and business magnate Andrew Carnegie, who accumulated a wealth of over $457 million over his lifetime, gave Hill the magic formula to write this money-making book. It took more than 20 years of researching and studying over 500 wealthy individuals to gather the information needed for this dubbed money bible. It's one of the most profound reads and will work wonders for business owners, entrepreneurs, or generally anyone who wishes for more success. Think and Grow is divided into 13 steps to riches chapters that go into detail about the mindset you need to have in order to reach success. Hill speaks about success in broader terms, not necessarily millionaire rich, but being socially and financially wealthy and breaking down the psychological barriers that are holding you back. His principles and suggested actions to take, steps to riches, include things like persistence, the power of thought, organization, focusing on long-term goals, and auto-suggestion. All is of course explained in further detail in the book and if applied correctly to your lifestyle will guide you to great success and riches. Hill also illustrates his theories through stories and examples. Think and Grow Rich has had over 100 million copies sold worldwide. 70 years after its publication, Business Week magazine put it as the 6th best-selling paperback business book. Its principles are still 100% relevant today and a top book for life. That ends the top best-selling books on money. If you got value from this video, please give it a like and share it with someone that will benefit. Are there some books that we missed that you think should have made the list? Drop the titles in the comments below. You can listen to any of the books on our list today on Audible. See the links to each of the books in our list in the description below. See you next time for some top bunk.